welcome to my channel. My name is Fonken Dolly. I am a Dubai based Cameroonian YouTuber. Mm, I see you guys. The hopes appeared on the previous video and then from nowhere the subscriber count started growing. Uh, thank you so much. I am grateful for you all. Today we are going to be talking about eyebrows. Mm -hmm. I did my makeup and I intentionally skipped uh, doing my eyebrows because recently I thread I got my eyebrows threaded and I went to my Facebook uh, account by the way if you don't follow me on my other social media accounts they'll be linked down in the description uh, box below on Instagram you can uh, follow me using my Instagram username is green eyes Barbie and Facebook you can say feel free to send me a um, friend request on Facebook of uh, I go by the name Funking Dolly so recently I, po I post this question on Facebook I was like Ladies, uh, do you wax, twist, thread, or microblade your eyebrows? And the comments were hilarious. Oh my god! Like, come on. one, there were a, a group of people who didn't know what I was talking about. They had no idea about what I was talking about. I was like, okay, that's interesting. And then let me read one or two comments for you guys. There was somebody who said, uh, I don't even know which one I do. But I know I always go to the shop and get one done. And then somebody else said she tweezes or uses the razor blade. And then uh, somebody said I wax. Oh my gosh, I tried the thread and I left that place with just one eyebrow done. I couldn't take the pain, yo. <laughs> and then another person wrote tweeze, thread. Now which one to know where? I read all these comments, the, the, the comments are really funny. I read all of them and I was like, okay, this is getting very interesting and that inspired me to film this video for you guys. Uh, obviously, there are several ways to groom your, your eyebrows. You can use, I have a tweezer here, this is what a tweezer looks like. For those who were confused or lost about what I was talking about, this is what a tweezer looks like. Because this is the old and famous blade which most people, I mean everybody knows about the razor blade yeah, those are the two uh, methods I have here but besides tweezing, besides using the, uh, a blade you can wax your eyebrows, you can thread your eyebrows and you can microblade so we'll be talking about, I'll be telling you guys the different methods and explaining what they are exactly so, so this is a razor blade, cheap, easy to use well not for me, that's the truth, I, I am not good with using a blade to groom my eyebrows um, but one of the, uh, the cons of using this is you have to be careful because I've had people uh, use the, the blade on my brows and, they, and I had little cuts so first you need to sterilize you have to make sure that the blade is sterilized or it is brand new and secondly you have to be careful while doing it so you don't have cuts and another uh, disadvantage with this is I am, a, I am hairy my hair will grow back after about three to four days after using this so you have to do this like every two three days for this man guys so this is the tweezer and basically let me show you guys what the tweezer does is for example if i had hair growing around this area of my brows you pluck off unwanted hair like this to give shape to your eyebrows it hurts yeah i've tried tweezing before not myself i didn't do it myself a pro did it for me i've tried it it hurts but it is a it's a fast method and the hair and you wouldn't need to do your brows for like a week or two depending if you're hairy of course so that's that for tweezers the next method is waxing they um first of all a pro has to do it let's be serious guys you have to go to a pro they will use the waxing gel to apply on your eyebrows for example, yeah, I've tried waxing before when I was in Cameroon, in Douala. It hurt like mad. Oh my god. And my skin reacted to waxing though. I got bumps like, around my eyebrows, which got me so worried. But it, it takes about 15 to 20 minutes to get it done. And yeah, my hair, it would last for about 2-3 weeks. Again, depending if you are hairy or not. And it was not expensive. I paid 3000 if I remember. And then we would go to threading. Threading was the, the the method I used recently. I think I did it last week, Wednesday. So this is what my eyebrows look like um, since Wednesday, and today is uh, Monday. This is what my eyebrows look like. It took about 15 to 20 minutes to get it done. 
girls can you believe that it is sewing thread like the thread you know that's what the girls who did uh, the threading on me that's what they use I filmed a short video while at the salon where they did my eyebrows so I'll insert it for you guys to see and threading is an alternative to tweezing or using um, or waxing yeah because some people are quite sensitive to waxing personally me the girls told me I would have to come back after about three weeks for them to clean up my brows again it was not expensive method is microblading which is also known as embroidery or feather touch basically microblading is a semi-permanent uh, tattoo method the reason why it's different from a tattoo is because they use tiny needles to deposit pigment uh, under the skin instead of a tattoo gun for those who have got the eyebrows tattooed before they know what I'm talking about you girls microblading is expensive depending on where you get it done but like from my the research I did, it goes to about nine hundred dollars. That's about four hundred and fifty thousand paying money, like four hundred and fifty thousand francs for eyebrows. Wow, that depends. That even depends where you get it done because it could go. It could be more expensive, and also it takes about an hour or so to get the entire procedure done. And it is you have to be very careful after you microblade your eyebrows. You don't have to profusely wet your brows immediately after. Uh, microblading you need to take some antibiotic you need to take some antibiotic treatment but the pros to getting your eyebrows microbladed your brows would, could last you up to three years yeah and you don't need you definitely don't need any retouching within the first year that you get it done like really imagine you wake up in the morning you do your makeup you don't have to touch your eyebrows that's amazing too that's so, um this is everything I had to tell you guys. Of course, there are a lot of things to consider. You have to weigh the pros and the cons of each of these methods. You, you have to work on your budget. You have to work on how much pain you can endure. Just for you guys to see that when you groom your eyebrows, it is so easy for you to fill them in when you're doing your makeup and everything. Um, I'll go ahead and just, you know, add some definition to my eyebrow. This is my eyebrow pencil. And I'll also be using an, an eyebrow gel, Revlon Bro Fantasy. Yeah, this is what it looks like. Let me just go ahead and fill in my brows. So this is what it looks like now you guys can see and then I'll go ahead and fill this side how easy was that guys like it took me a minute or so wow yeah so it's up to you to use any of these um, methods for your eyebrow thank you guys for watching this is the end of the video i know us women we do the most when it comes to taking care of our skin but i mean that's what being a woman is if you enjoy watching this video don't forget to click the subscribe button and to thumbs up and see you guys in my next video stay blessed bye